What would happen if we actually decided to change? Ready for if we use the Bible. If we use the Bible. The Bible. To help us with everyday situations. Our friends, our music, our families. Is there any topic the Bible doesn't cover? This. 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 This is iTopics. Did you know that the Bible is the number one most historically accurate document of all time? Take King David, for instance. He was written about in the Bible thousands of years ago. You know, David and Goliath, the slingshot. But the rest of the world didn't figure out about him until 1993, when archaeologists found a stone tablet with his history on it, with his dynasty, the House of David. A lot of people say that they believe the Bible used to be true, but after it's been copied so many times, they just don't know if they can trust it anymore. Have you ever heard of the Dead Sea Scrolls? About 90 years ago, some shepherds went into a cave and found these clay pots. So they took them to some archeologists, and once they got them open, they found the Dead Sea Scrolls, which are handwritten copies of the Bible. They found every book of the Old Testament except Esther. And when they compared that to the Bible we have now, it was all correct. You can't change the word of God. I can remember asking my dad, is the Bible even worth studying or is it just another book? And so he asked me what year I was born, which he should remember, he was there, 1993. And his response is something I will never forget. 1,993 years after the baby Jesus was born. Apparently, this man changed the world so much that they decided to base time off of his birth. That was enough to get me studying. So you see, the Bible isn't only a book. It's the most historically accurate document of all time. But above that, it's the living word of God. And it still has the power to change lives today.